Even if you've never laid eyes on a Harry Potter book, you've certainly heard of Merlin. You know, the most famous wizard ever. And let's be real, even if you've never laid eyes on a Harry Potter book, you've certainly heard of Slytherin as well. With these two things in mind, let's talk about J.K. Rowling's revelation on Pottermore that Merlin not only attended Hogwarts, but was a Slytherin. But how was Merlin a Slytherin when legend says he lived before Hogwarts was even founded? A charm specialist sometimes known as the Prince of Enchanters, Merlin is undoubtedly the most famous wizard of all time. According to canon, Merlin studied at Hogwarts not only that, but was a Slytherin. He then eventually joined the court of King Arthur and used his tremendous magical skills to help build the Kingdom of Camelot, where muggles and wizards could work and live together. Now, that being said, it has left many to question how Merlin went to Hogwarts, when legend says he was around before Hogwarts was even founded. Rowling's version of Merlin must have been based on Geoffrey of Monmouth's work, which is why she would say that Merlin was a student at Hogwarts. Merlin's legend goes back as far as the 6th century, several centuries before Hogwarts was even built. Rowling wanted to include Merlin in her work as a legendary figure, but had also decided to set the founding of Hogwarts later, in the Middle Ages, not later antiquity, for various reasons. Thus, a problem arose. It's a plot hole that could be considered poetic license. Maybe Merlin did live in the 10th century, but his name was later confused with that of a wizard who predated him. The most likely explanation, however, is that J.K. Rowling took creative license with the story of Merlin and decided to place him in the Harry Potter universe. So whilst Merlin's legend may be situated before Hogwarts was founded, it is likely that Rowling changed the dates to situate Merlin in Harry Potter. So the Merlin of Harry Potter is not necessarily the same Merlin of legend. It is fiction after all. So it's important to note that if Merlin studied at Hogwarts, he didn't study in Slytherin House centuries before it was founded. The character of Merlin in the Harry Potter books lived after Hogwarts was founded. Rowling usually doesn't provide any dating for Merlin other than informing us that he was part of the court of King Arthur. The clearest bounds that we can get from Merlin's life is that he lived somewhere between the 12th and 15th centuries. In the Book of Spells, when the disarming charm is discussed, it states that historians disagree about the origins of this charm and that some claim that it was invented by Merlin himself, others that it was in widespread use in Madagascar as early as the 11th century. In order for existence as early as the 11th century to prove that Merlin didn't invent it, Merlin must have not been around in the 11th century. We also know that the Order of Merlin has been awarded since the 15th century. For the Order of Merlin to have been established in commemoration of Merlin, he must have been alive before it was created. It could have been created while he was still alive or even created by him, but it could also have been made long after he died. Seeing as the Harry Potter version of Merlin lived somewhere between the 12th and 15th centuries, it makes sense that he would have studied at Hogwarts and been sorted into a house. The main mistake seems to be assuming that characters appearing in the Harry Potter universe are identical to the real world characters they are based off. So I think the main problem here is that most people, when they hear that Merlin is a Slytherin, assume that it's the Merlin of legend but we're talking about fiction here. So it is very likely that J.K. Rowling just decided to change the dates and take a bit of creative license with the character of Merlin and place him in the Harry Potter universe in a timeline that would suit the story. Although there is one other explanation. It could just come down to a timeline error. J.K. Rowling has already admitted that she isn't the best with dates. 
It is important to note that the Merlin of British legend is not a real person, but is based on various people from before the year 1000 in the Common Era. However, since Rowling's Merlin was a Slytherin, we can speculate that he must have lived after the school was founded, circa 990 Common Era. For the sake of argument, we'll assume that the Merlin of Rowling's world lived sometime between the 12th and 15th centuries, and that Merlin is not the same Merlin that we know from history.